Yeah. Wow. Aw, oh, snap. It's time to announce the winners of the Jeff and Taylor Valentine's Day Fan Art Contest. 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 That's right. Today's the day. It's V-Day. No, not that V-Day, which I think it's about a World War II or something. It is Valentine's Day. Today. That's right. But yeah. Of course. <laughs> All right. That's enough. So yeah, I hope you're having a wonderful Valentine's Day, and and if it's not Valentine's Day when you're watching, I hope you're having a good day otherwise. Well, it is here, folks. The I'll be announcing the winners, showing you uh, the, uh, the 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 submissions. I've gotten six submissions. Way to go, dude! I know. I was expecting uh, like maybe three or something, but thankfully, you guys are awesome. And I've gotten six submissions. If I missed any, I am so sorry. I, I, I looked everywhere in my, in my email and everything, and my messages are, are pretty, uh, pretty clean. Um, you know, they're cleared out. So I don't think I missed any. But just in case, if you did try to submit something, please let me know. And I will see it. And I'll um, show it off in the next video. All right, so let's look at the submissions, shall we? This first submission that I got here is from my friend Stacy Teague. And oh, look at that. It is Captain Starla with David. And of course, she has to drag David um, to a picnic. Um, in order for her to do that, though, she has to uh, tie him up because he'll just leave. You know, if you're going to have a date with David, might as well have it be against his will. That's how Starlo rolls. She is a very fun bad guy for me to write, you know? I try to make her lovable and hateable at the same time. She says the most heinous things about certain people, but her... She's very vulnerable and cute when it comes to, you know, love and, and David. And why would anybody want to fall in love with David? I don't know. He has a lot of growing up to do. <laughs> well... Yeah, you know, let's see what we have here. We ha in the picnic in the picnic basket we have bread, uh, wine, I think. I think that's a blanket or it could be a huge slice of cheese. It makes sense, wine and cheese, you know. And she and that's probably circus cheese, you know, just like there's circus peanuts where it's terrible terrible candy. Uh, that's a circus that's circus cheese where it's just terrible cheese. All right? They, in layman terms, we call it melt. So that was nice. Very, uh, thank you so much, Stacy. Next submission is from Curtis. We have Jeff and Jane on a date at a pizza place. And man, it makes me crave for pizza. I miss pizza. I miss going out and sitting, you know, in a table, eating pizza. I think it's almost been a year since I've actually sat down in a restaurant. Well, at least Jeff and Jane don't have to worry about that. Oh, give me a break. Pepperoni pizza, I assume. No, it's cheese pizza. And they're wearing the same pants, the same exact uh, aqua pants. That's a couple right there if you wear the same thing. Just about. That relationship goes. Go ahead, girl. Next submission is from Katrina the Corgi. So cute. So cute. Cassidy and Taylor. A lot of people ship them together, which, you know, I agree. They are wonderful together. I'd buy that for a dollar. They're both air signs, wouldn't you know? Cassidy's a Gemini. Taylor is a Libra. So, in theory, they should uh, work well together. So we have Cassidy, uh, you know, kissing Taylor on the cheek. And everything looks so cool. It reminds me of graffiti, uh, graffiti art. You know, airbrush art, you know, that kind of... You know that kind of art it has that style and it looks neat very very expressive hey yeah beautiful hair next submission is from john toon studios yes! jeff giving jane um some uh, some roses a bouquet of roses and you know you i've seen his art style before and and it looks here that he's uh tr um, trying to do something new which i appreciate 
You know, it's very cool. Well, let's see what it, re it says here. Jeff and Taylor, the Broadway musical, Will Jane Say Yes? I hope so. I hope Jane says yes. And I like that bow in her hair. That, um, that hair tie slash bow. Looks very cute on her. And Jeff is looking like a man. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Next submission is this wonderful piece by um, Gwazdka. I'm sorry if I mispronounced your name. Gwazdka. But my gosh, this is so adorable. Jane and Cassidy together. You know, I, I guess what I see here, Cassidy, you know, confesses her love to Jane, you know, and um, you know, giving her chocolate and Jane is so impressed and all of a sudden she, she, uh, she's a lesbian now. She just discovered that she's a lesbian and they're going to live happily ever after together while Jeff just looks at them. Disappointed and he'll never speak again. Poor Jeff. Nah, I'm not trying to uh, damper this picture. I love it. I really do. The technique, the the style, the um, the characters inside the heart kind of reminds me of what I did during the stream. Great minds think alike. I really love this piece, and you did a great job. I love your art style, Gwatska. I like it a lot. It's, it's awesome. So cute. Wow. <laughs> and the final submission is from Ida Law. Jeff and Jane together. Looks like they're watching the stars. Out at night, Jane's wearing Jeff's hat. Go ahead, girl. Jeff doesn't have his glasses on, which is a rare move. You know, I think he's trying to impress Jane, you know, take off those glasses so she can see, you know, his eyes better. His handsome eyes. His gentle eyes. You know, but not too close because he'll, he'll look tired. You know, he'll look like he's on drugs or something. Speaking out of personal experience, you know. Everybody says that I look like I'm on drugs or I'm high whenever I'm, you know, whenever I have my glasses off. Which is not true. I don't take drugs. Say no, kids. No to drugs. Say yes to love. Yes! Which is this. I love the art style here. The colors. You did a bang up job, Ida. Or Ida. Ida Law. That's his name. <laughs> so cool. So there you have it. Those are the submissions. Six submissions. And like I said in my announcement video, only five winners. Well, looks like I have to pick five out of the six. But luckily, I got a text from Stacy, my friend. And she says that she volunteers to be taken out of the running. Because to her, it seems unfair. Where, because we're, we're friends and I know her. I mean, I can always give her the poster when I, when, I, when, I, when I see her in person again. So, I think that's fair. That's very fair, and that's very cool of Stacy to, to volunteer to, to opt out of the prize. Which means, the rest of you guys that submitted are winners. Oh, yeah. Yeah, everybody's a winner. Except Stacy. <laughs> no, no, I'm just kidding. But for real, if you want to follow Stacy, this is her Twitter handle. I mean, she re really needs more Twitter followers. She's a very underrated comic artist. And, yeah, I support her work as she supports mine. We've known each other since high school. But it's funny because we've recently been friends at way after high school. <laughs> but, but that's a whole different story. Alright, so that's it guys, um, fan art contest is, it was a, it was a success. Next contest I'll announce pretty soon, probably next month, it has to do, it's, it has to do with the quickies, and it's a much bigger project, you know, a much bigger contest. I might even allow you guys to work on their, on your submissions for like months, because the winner of that will have their comic strip or their Jeff and Taylor comic strip be featured inside the uh, the third quickie book. So yeah. I'll announce that pretty soon, officially. So that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching my videos, for some, for subscribing to me, for, for being fans, you know? I mean, sometimes I doubt myself saying that maybe I'm making cartoons for no reason. 
but you know it's living proof that you guys you know you guys you know making fan art for me is living proof that I'm doing something good okay all right I better leave I'm talking too much so I'll see you guys next time in fact I think next time will be a slideshow a fan art slideshow I'll collect all the fan art that I've um, received over the past 10 years or so and put it into a slideshow. And, you know, we'll all enjoy. Okay? I think that'll be fun. It's my little tribute to you. My little love gesture to you guys. Okay. I think to close this out, I'll show off my uh, special Valentine gifts um, or drawings of the um, official... JNT ships. Alright guys, here you go. JFM out. Have a wonderful day. 